Welcome to MATT55.com. We are looking for all the good people in the world like you to help us feed all the children in the world so no child goes asleep hungry again. Due to the upcoming famine, there's an estimated 1 billion people in the world that will die from starvation by 2025. And most of those are orphans that are located in third world countries. We are looking to sponsor as many orphans as we can in the world. We have created a system where like-minded people can come together for a one-time cost of only $50. If you are a business or have been blessed to be able to donate more, our goal is $1 million. This will help sponsor 20,000 orphans in the world. We are affiliated with a nonprofit and any donation amount can be a tax write-off. We are looking to visit over 35 orphanages for our very first trip to Uganda in Africa. There are thousands of children that are living on only one meal every two days on average. And that meal is just usually rice and beans. Currently, orphanages around the world have been asking for donations of money to help buy food for the children. Then the next month, they continue to ask again for more money. This is the definition of insanity. Doing something over and over again, trying to find a different outcome. At MATT55.com, we will teach all the children to grow their own food. We are looking for 50 people to go with us to help build a system at each orphanage. We will be educating all the children to help plant gardens and to raise chickens for eggs and meat. There are many things we can do to teach the children to grow their own food. So there is no need to continue to donate money on a monthly basis in the future. We will build it. We will teach the children how to grow their own food. Then they will teach their children. This is the way. Enjoy the video. Please subscribe, like, comment, and share. If we don't do this, who will? It takes a village. Let us come together and just say no to hunger. Feed the children, save the world. I did go in earlier. Um, we didn't have certain staff in there, so I didn't think we was going to be able to do a, a nice presentation, but we can. And this is our brother right here, your security, right? What is the name of this orphanage? What, what is the name of the orphanage? Excellent. And uh, what uh, township are we in? What's the township name? Township means Cape Town. No, Cape Town is the city. It's Kailicha. So family is still here in the same township. And uh, just to uh, let you visually see it. All right, and these are the beautiful children in the orphanage. Hello, how, how is everybody doing? Hello, hello. How, how, how is everybody doing? Are you guys all right? Yes. And family, what you're gonna see is some of these houses. Like this one right here, this is a, um, as you see, a container unit. And you have several houses that go all the way back, different colors, donated also to different people. Talk, I'm done. Mr. Bomani and, <laughs> and Rakim, thank you for passing to let me uh, get some documentation for the children. Yeah, I like I like how the, I like how these colors of these containers look. Yeah. And these are these are some of the staff that take care of the children and. Family, this is a big uh, compound, and a lot of the children that live here are in an organized position where people have. I'm gonna take a picture. Huh? You're gonna get counted by kids. Hey, good luck. Hello, little, hello, little people. I was back here earlier. Tando, I'm back, uh, and I gotta document this. Uh, Yeah. 
This is where the kids are kept. And as I said, the ladies, they, they have two sets of ladies, one that works during the day, um, who serves as mothers because to give them a, 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 a sense of family life. Um, and, and that is daytime, nighttime there's another group. Bearing in mind also that all of these kids are HIV positive. One hundred percent or most of them? Most of them. And most of them, as you said, have been thrown away. They no. have been abandoned, yeah. So that, oh, oh, and so that these kids are, are also on medication. Hey. This, uh, most of them are on medication. And that's why, as, as we go into all these rooms, you will see there will always be a refrigerator to keep the medication. Um, more. Also, Tanya, uh, earlier, earlier we, we were walking back there, and, and you're giving some good information. Can you, can I, can you, can you uh, show us the rest of the property? All right. So, family, a room full of blankets. So it's one of those situations, family. We do our best to make our way around certain institutions and. When you deal with Run, run. Cluster houses are set up so that kids can have um, experience of family uh, of a house. So we will have kids of the same age, same gender, maybe six or eight of them living in a room uh, in a in a little house where they will have a mother who will serve them. They will have a little bit of chores to do so that they can have that feeling that there is somebody that's taking care and they can take care of. Yeah, absolutely. And this is their playground. This is their facility. This is their facility. Now the state, gentlemen, the kids, the cat, it is material. Otherwise, it will be child exploitation. Uh-uh. To touch the dirt? Uh -huh. Now, as I said, the houses, the five houses that we're now passing was bought by um, by Elton, Sir Elton John, and it is built on the scene of the Lion King, so you will have the names of Samba, Rafiki, etc. Mulvini,
Oh, so you're one of the children, you are part of the she group, big. and you grow big, and now you're cooking for... Yeah, she cooking. You, I, how many of you are living in this house? Eight children. Eight, eight children? Boys or girls? Girls. Only. I ah, so you oh. cooking. Are ah, you cooking for the girls? Nice. And, 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 and what are your age groups? Okay. Um, and so if it's a must be little girls, you must know. And this is the most challenging time for these girls because they're now going into what is called adolescent stage. Yes, and they become, and then suddenly they find out that they've okay, we have actually never been sexually active because they were born with it. Most of these kids are born with HIV. And it's, Oh. That's why they're abandoned. Oh. But what, what they don't know, most women, kids born with HIV, when they grow, grow, grow um, they take out their own blood. Ah, yeah. So I'm, after a, some of them don't really yeah. get it. But, but, they, but they will still carry the stigma. Yeah. Because most of us don't die of the disease. We die because of the stigma attached to the disease. Mm. Mental. The mental is it, it, it takes it, over the physicality. No, it is. It, 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 it's the skull of, of HIV. This is the HIV Yeah, this is oh, all the whole, most of the, all of it. Uh, and then on the other side, we have those that are dying. Oh, so, so continue so to the other presentation. Uh -huh. American flag? El Koshi, El meaning thank you. Because we thank you? Yeah. Okay, you see? Don't feed them too much, though. <laughs> 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 now, you mentioned another house where children are dying. Um, that will be the hospice on the other side, uh, so that they can die in dignity. And other, the this aspects. other... Yeah, that will be the hospice. Yeah. No, that is to, to generate money to, for these kids. They have a bakery. That's like the clinic? Uh, no, that is a bakery to generate money. So they will bake bread and mm -hmm. sell it into the community. Yes. And that's it. So that they don't into, they're not into begging. Uh, most of these kids do go to school. They will be going, they go to school outside. Um, for them, uh, it is to allow them to meet up with other kids within right. the community. Otherwise, it would be like a prison. So what's going on in this house? Hello, are you? Hello. Oh, and it's taken down the apple. Oh, they said we've already eaten. Oh, they said we've already eaten. Okay. Someone is taking a bath, so we can't go like that. Oh. Yeah, I don't want to. Okay. I don't, don't think realize so. Yeah. 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 So you will then notice that it is, it is the international community. This is a Canada house? Yeah, this is how it is. Actually, it has become, it started up as a little shack. And most of the houses that you see here were built by our visitors. Oh, so Canada village. Yeah. Like, I saw one that was, was, was by, by Germany. Yeah, that one. Yeah. And, and, and those pink, these colorful houses was, was donated by Elton John. Okay, how long ago was that? El Elton John comes every year. Oh, this, he is, did. He, this is his baby. Oh. Oh, oh, this is his project, okay. Yeah. Okay. Um, then, of course, the Hollanders and the Irish, during the, uh, during the World Cup, they also donated houses. 
And I won't ask, I won't, I won't want you to show out which house belongs to Holland. <laughs> I'm sure I can figure that one out, <laughs> the Dutch. <laughs> It looked like a replica of what they have. Yeah, so See? this one will be the Dutch. That's a Dutch house. Huh? No, the Dutch house, the house, the royal house of the of the Dutch is the house of orange. Hello. This, orange. Oh, the this, color. This. Oh, the flag. Oh, yeah. You look at the flag. No, because the royal house is the house of orange. They call it the house of orange. And this is Mullen. This is corn. Now most of these kids, most of Stop right now. Stop right now. I said stop right now. Stop right now. I don't say you guys aren't angry, but we have visitors. You can't be acting like that. Thank you. Stop right now. Okay? I thought you guys were playing with me. I saw I see you acting crazy. Stop doing that. Okay? Cool down, please. Soccer is a game of fun. You have you play in fun and excitement. Okay? You don't you don't fight your your, 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 your opponent, you're playing a game, but you play a game and you beat them with skills and talent, not your fists and your hands. Okay? I don't want to see you guys fighting over it. You guys got to work together. We as black people have to work together. We will never get anywhere, okay? So we have to learn that from a young age. Be nice, okay? So you guys play soccer. I was enjoying you guys' soccer match. <laughs> We used to do this in Jamaica when I was younger, just playing soccer like this. See this family, we're still at the orphanage and this comes to the end of the orphanage. Um, so as you can see, this is one long connection oh, yeah. and everything. Very long. So this, is, what, this was a goalie, this was a goal, son. Yes, a goal. So they're playing so put it back as you got it, please. That's not how you got it. Put it back, put it, fix it for him. Show. Yeah, they're playing soccer in you know. Fix your goal. <laughs> All right, now we continue. Are you guys play nice, man? Play nice. You promise you're gonna play nice? My man, you, you promise you're gonna play nice? Play nice, okay? Hey, my man. Look, a little man in blue. I want you to play nice with your brothers, okay? We're, we're one people. We have to stay strong, okay? We have, you're a bigger man, take care of your brothers and sisters. Okay, perfect. Family, now the tour has ended and we have to head back, so I wish we could spend more time, but um, we have a lot of good documentation and we're ready to proceed. But thank you for the invitation, uh, Sharon. This is, very, this is very special. Thank you. Um, Oh, well, thank you. <laughs> so, yes, family, uh, we're in Cape Town, and you know, I'm just doing my best to connect us to an experience and connect us to our, our brothers and sisters. So, this is the orphanage, and it's one of those orphanages that need help. And also, Sharon, you're going to provide me with the donation information, all those things. I'm going to put it in the video. So, if anyone feels in their heart, like all these other I'll countries who donate a house, then they can do it also. Okay. Uh, yes. So that was a good idea what you suggested earlier. Thank you. And that's more, more of the important thing with the videos because they get around and you never know the right set of people may come in and really invest in this community. What and it's the same thing. Happens? And it's the same thing we did when we went to Pilanesburg. And it's the same thing we did in Pilanesburg. I remember this when I was in Jamaica as a young boy. Yeah, time. <laughs> Do I remember this in Jamaica? <laughs> yeah, time.
Hey, Mr. Bomani, good attitude, good energy, man. Thank you, man. Let's go. Let's go head back and go on the Ferris wheel and go uh, enjoy some dinner out at the ocean front. This is high security. <laughs> 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 what? All right, um, let's board. Uh, anybody back there? We just gotta get them going. I want to thank you, Tando. You've been awesome. You've been great, and um, wealth of knowledge. And you know, we're gonna keep in touch and keep it strong. Yeah, so. I'm grateful too. All right, anybody else back there, John? We would like to just inform you about the situation at the restaurant. Oh, that's cool. That's all. Give me a second. Let me close on this. All right, son. We're coming right there. Okay. Okay.